I just thought I'd show you a bit of uh, my layout which I'm building. It's a real location. This is in Tottenham, was in Tottenham. Well, the roads are still there, but the railway's not there. This is Phillip Lane, West Green Road, Belmont Road, Langham Road. And the station there was called West Green. Uh, there's a park behind called Downhills Park. That's still there. Haven't built on it yet. Um, it was in a, the station was in a cutting. There's the West Green. It went to Seven Sisters and then on to North Woolwich by South Tottenham. The other end went to Palace Gates. I'm, I'm going to call it Fieldgate Street, so I'm not going to model that. Uh, line closed, 7th of January, 1963. Thanks, Dr. Beechin, for nothing. May you burn in hell. No, I shouldn't say that. <laughs> so um, this was how it was. There was uh, the station, a signal box, two lines, Trailing crossover under Belmont Road Bridge into a carriage siding, a four yard um, coal and goods yard with a run round loop. This was at street level, so the station was lower. Uh, I've just I can model just about all of this. I haven't got enough distance between there and there. I probably need about another ten feet, so I've got to comp I've got to compensate. Uh, but I'm going to do it as best I can. This is my back garden. How'd you like me uh, passion fruit, cucumbers, tomatoes? Check this out. Whoa, rhubarb. It's nice for custard. Why did I show you that? Because the lines actually, I'm going to extend the line around the back of the shed. That's where it's going to go. My wife don't know that yet. I'll tell her later. So this is where West Green is, under my pergola. Hopefully this will make sense. This is where the goods yard's going to go. I haven't got enough room, so I'm going to have to simplify it. This is going to be West Green Station Building, the platforms I've got built. That's going to be Downhills Park on the back scene. If we come up here, this is 22 foot long. That's Belmont Road Overbridge up here. Uh, there's the line into the goods yard. This is a trailing crossing. Uh, the signal box is going to go about there. So the line goes round, uh, because I haven't got a straight enough run, it goes around the corner down the side of the house. I don't do anything with this side of the house, so this is a good place. From here right down to the end is 65 feet. That's where Fieldgate Street Station is down the end, or will be. Here is the carriage sidings. I've got to hook all this up, I've just built these points. So there's the connection back to the main line and there's the two road carriage siding. So this is my terminus station, Fieldgate Street, which is where Palace Gates would have been. I can't do everything. So this is Fieldgate Street. I'm going to put another road bridge here and uh, over the back here. Oh, this is just the covers, I'm going to put uh, an embankment. And I'm going to use this stuff. I got this for nothing, I found it. It's a uh, fake grass. So I'm going to build an embankment and ballast all this. So this is my main line. It's quite a good run, 65 feet. And then the turn and then the station. So I've got about 90 odd feet all up. And this is where my um, West Green carriage side and starts. So I've got to lay all this. I've just built these uh, turnouts from kits. It's all pretty good. Thanks for watching on today after building that turnout. Don't worry about that. That's just a uh, ballast some track down. I just want to keep it level. The glue will hold it in place. So this is the turnouts. These are the first ones I've ever ballasted. They look pretty neat. And uh, they work all right. Obviously, I have to clean it up a bit. I'm sure the glue, will, the wood glue, will get down there. And uh, but I can get that out. There's no grit, no ballast down there, so that's good. So I've done all that. I've just got to build the carriage sidings now and finish the ballasting down the end.